interesting thing, and kind of gross, at least back then, is what these tunnels were made out of. These shrimp actually made like a wall around themselves to make sure they had a nice safe tunnel that didn't fill them with sand. So what do you think he would have used? Rock, yeah, he would use rock, he would use some of the sand, and then he would use something to make it kind of stick together, like a glue. Oh, poop. Yeah, there you go. He would use his own poop Ew. with sand and make a little wall around himself, and now we're seeing that poop tunnel for fossilized right there. I thought shrimps were clean. I know. Uh, but the so good thing is, this is 50 million years old, so it's not dirty anymore. It's just minerals now. Yeah. Yeah, this used to so, be a uh, beach. Oh, all yeah. evidence of the beach. And you know how you go to the beach and there's waves? Yeah. And it sometimes makes little ripple marks underneath the water, right? Well, we actually have fossils of that right here. So these are fossilized ocean wavelength ripples from the tide going in and the tide going out. I'm going to get a little easier to see if my light from the right angle. Kind of like that. So this is when the tide would go in, the tide would go out kind of leaving those little ripples and you're seeing layers upon layers upon layers of it built up right there. See the little waves in it? Uh, it goes up and up and up like little waves. So those are called clay draped ripple marks <laughs> is the official scientific term for them. So very, very, very cool stuff. Uh, this was the beach right here. And you might even have fossilized raindrop impressions right there in this one section of what, what used to be mud. Uh, those little indentations that come down toward you. Now that's a theory, so that one's not as uh, concrete as, well, I like to call the shrimp creek tunnels. <laughs> Instead of concrete, it's my shrimp creek, where they made their own little fossilized walls. So yeah, this is Fossil Alley for all those reasons right there. There's a train right there and up there the ocean. Out in the ocean, oh yeah, these shrimps are still out there. And even if you go to the Monterey Bay Aquarium, like I said, you can go look at these guys in person. Pretty cute.